Hello everyone. So this video is going to be an informational video on what to feed your baby bunnies. Um, here I have my four week old bunny that I just rescued about two days ago. I have not introduced her to my channel yet so this is the first time um, people who have been watching my videos will see her. Um, I'm not sure what I'm going to name her yet. I was thinking Muffin or Piper. I really like Piper but I don't know. I have to watch her personality and then decide. So I want to talk about what to feed a four week old bunny. Um, when I seen her, I was in a shelter. I was actually looking at puppies because I've been looking to get a puppy lately. Um, and I had no luck so I went into the cat part of the shelter and they happened to have bunnies. And she was the only baby bunny there. They were only feeding her Timothy pellets and um, no hay or anything and she was in a very very small cage so I couldn't help I could not pass her up I had to take her home and give her a good home <laughs> and um, I can't wait to see as she gets older she's already has a little personality to her she was very scared when I first got her she w didn't like to be held or pet or anything but now she'll come right up to me and she likes to sniff and she's very very brave She's already becoming a good little girl. As you can see, she's warming up to me. It's only been two days, and I'm, I mean, as I feed her and give her water, she um, is starting to come up to me in the mornings and tell me that she needs water and food. Um, so basically what you should be feeding a four-week-old bunny um, is alfalfa pellets and alfalfa hay. And right over here in this corner, I have alfalfa hay. Um, in this bowl, I have alfalfa pellets. And um, the reason why you feed young bunnies alfalfa-based products is because they have the nutrients that a bunny needs to grow and grow healthy. Um, Timothy-based hay and pellets are more for when your bunny reaches about six months old, when you should really transition them over. It's okay to feed them Timothy hay and Timothy pellets while they're young, but they won't be getting the nutrients that they need. <laughs> there goes her water bowl. And you have to have water available to your baby bunny at all times. I tend to raise my baby bunnies on a bowl-based water instead of a water bottle. As you can see, um, some of her bedding gets in here and all of that. It gets dirty, so I have to clean it about three times a day. But you should always have water available to your baby bunny. It's always have pellets and hay available to her um, because as they are young, you don't um, suppress their diet until they are six months. So until they are six months, they should have unlimited supply of pellets and hay. And then once they are six months, you should cut pellets down to about one or two scoops a cup or so. It's, it all depends on their weight. And if you look up online, it tells you exactly what you should give them. So once they get six months um, is when they should be on Timothy-based products only. But until then, it is a free range of eating um, unlimited amounts until they are six months old of alfalfa-based. Uh, you can start introducing veggies into your bunny's diet when they are 12 weeks old. You will want to introduce them slowly and um, carefully because your bunny can get what is called poopy butt, which is diarrhea. And um, it could be dangerous for your bunny, so you want to be careful and introduce veggies very slowly. I would say only a p little tiny piece of lettuce at a time, um, only once a day slowly and check um, their droplings each day to see how they're doing with it. Um, so yeah, this video is about wrapped up, I believe. I've given all the information um, what to feed your baby bunny. Also, if your baby bunny is um, under four weeks old, then she should be on mama's milk. And if you have an orphan bunny, 
and you don't have mama on the property and you were raising your bunny on your own, you should only use KMR kitten milk, um, the replacement milk that you find in stores. Don't use puppy milk, don't use um, regular cow milk, don't use any of that. Only kitten replacement milk. So I believe that's it for this video guys. Um, I hope this video was very informational for you and I will have upcoming videos on my little baby right here. <laughs> and for those of you that are wondering, this is her temporary cage as she was she is a baby. I'm actually going to be building a CNC cage. As you can see right here. I will be building her a CNC cage and she'll have a huge cage with a bunch of toys. Right now she's very young, so I'm keeping her here. Now I think I hear my cats calling me, so I have to go. Um Thank you guys for watching this video. Um, make sure you feed your baby bunnies responsibly and and um, happy bunny days. <laughs>